This is a lifetime educational videos. Hello visors, it is another fun day that we've got to give you more videos. Anger is a strong feeling of annoyance, displeasure or hostility. For many of us we are always carried away with this condition that we sometimes lose control of ourselves, but not to worry about it. Today we bring you the ways you can implement by your own and find your way into controlling this situation. For many of us we always feel that it is the end of the world and we can do anything that we want forgetting if the feelings are controllable or not. It is sometimes a condition that may require the attention of the psychologist if in case it exceeds the manageable limit, meaning that the mind is no longer in control of it. Welcome to Colina Vid, the place where future successful people come to feel at home. If not subscribed yet, you are missing out, hit the subscribe and turn on the bell. It is worse that sometimes this condition may lead you to a rehabilitation center simply because you are not that careful and you don't want to put your thinking into it. The trick is just so simple, try this, since for most of us we normally forget if our minds are still functioning as they should be and that's why we always end up doing what leaves our friends, neighbors and whoever relates to us in one way or another with rhetorical questions they think has no answers to account for. Here are 10 ways to handle your anger without having to hurt anyone, stay close until the end of the video. Number 1. Stop talking. As number 1 in our list, come to think of it, do you ever notice that whenever the anger rises, you end up sometimes saying things that has no meaning? And to some of us, we tend to stammer? Well it is because the brain automatically overrates things around leaving you with no option than to react to everything around and through this, it overthinks. This can lead to a bit of stress that you get yourself into without knowing and I dare you that, at this level, you do not have any authority over what you do or what you say. The best way to calm yourself down and avoid all these is to stop the talking and do the reasoning. It may be a challenge, but doing it will actually relax your mind and bring to normal. Try it now and see how you can train yourself so easily. Number 2. Repeat a mantra. A mantra is any word or that is repeated to aid concentration. In all languages there are those sweet words or sounds that at some point you ever found yourself saying, but you never realize how powerful they might be to your mental condition. Know this today that repetition of these words in a situation like anger, will automatically calm you down and bring you to your senses within a duration that will amaze you. But you may ask, but Fit, what are the examples of these words? Well, since our priority lies with you, the examples are such as, take it easy, and you'll be fine, and your name. The repetition of these words will automatically calm you down without you realizing it. Anger is always something that if you are not careful enough, it may lead you into making decisions that you might regret in future. Number 3. Take a cup of cold water. This is another way that will calm you down if you're really mad. Do you ever realize it that, the moment your anger rises, the body temperature also goes high? This is because the brain tends to overthink and overrate things around you and you feel like you can fight with anything that you find by your way. To add, the heart beat rate also increases since more energy is required by the body especially the brain. Taking a cup of cold water relaxes the muscles involved leaving you at peace with the mind. Have you ever noticed that some people do not take a walk without a bottle of water in their hands? That is the answer for all that because you never at what point you might be messed up with. Train on this and make your brain be aware of this all the time. Number 4. Countdown. Here is another great way that will calm you down in seconds. The main aim of this to distract your mind from the ill think, to thinking of numbers. We must bet that it is the easiest way to calm you down much faster compared to other ways. Our assumption is that no one should be able to count from 1 to 10 or even backwards, the truth is that the moment you are upset, the brain tends to forget about the pattern making it sometimes too challenging to handle. The promise is that, putting your effort into it and you will find yourself managing through it. Number 5. Take a walk out. Another nice one, there is always nothing joyful like just taking a peaceful walk and so your mind must love it. This way that aims at distracting your mind by just taking a stroll in the compound. You must have observed such a behavior in some people or two people were arguing and at some point, one of them decides to walk away, and that is always the reason behind it. How this works, it relaxes your muscles involved with heart beat rate and the vessels that supply the brain with blood filled with nutrients. To some people, 
The level of anger and stress may stop them from even walking. And now you may ask how you could walk if cannot even contain the energy that will enable you to stand. That is why we never stopped here. It brings us to the next way you can use to calm yourself down. Number 6. Sleep. A lot of people prefer this as their way of reducing anger. This tends to be the easiest way to lower down your steam. The aim of this is to help your mind calm down easily without much effort or much use of energy. Sleeping is always designed as a bridge between your past and your present and through this, you will realize that the brain tends to have forgotten about what was going on immediately when you wake up. The good side is that, sleeping does not require more energy as in the case of taking a walk. The only thing it requires of you is to convince your mind that everything is alright so that it can settle down to sleep. Again you cannot easily sleep when your mind is so wandering, it will keep on thinking and rethinking, again and again. Since this is the easiest way, the best thing you can do is to train your mind into it and I promise you that everything needs adaptation and for you to adapt successfully, you need to highly sacrifice your time and a peace of mind. Number 7. Play some tunes. Everything we have ever done to calm us down, there is nothing as calming as listening to your favorite music tunes. It automatically carries away your brain and by the time the tune comes to its stop, it is already solved. In all the ways we stated, we must advise you that this one is the best. To those who claim to have no passion in listening to music, it seems like a disadvantage. But as we stated earlier, everything is all about training yourself into that will get you adapting so fast. As they said that nothing with an advantage must also possess disadvantage, this point might be stressful as depending on the level of anger. It is difficult to even think of listening to music since every tune you tend to play may turn out to be noisy. If we might guess properly, nobody needs training in this but the brain automatically adapts to music tunes without even realizing it, so it's not a big deal. Number 8. Talk about it. There is about nothing tough like avoiding to say an issue or something that you think can be solved through a simple conversation. People misquote their own friends like those who like talking, but they never realize how powerful the so-called speaking a lot can be of great help to you. The point here is not just talk a lot but talks with an aim of easing your mind from so much thinking and unnecessary reasoning that might land you into so much future regrets. If you have been so observing, avoiding to speak it out automatically gives it a priority to haunt you later. So for some cases, we would advise you to try telling it out to avoid landing into unnecessary regrets in future. Number 9. Take a bath. You never thought that this might be on our list right? Well, to start with, bathing is always as always important as it not only keeps you clean but also ensures that your mind is in a stable condition, that is healthy state. This works when you take a cold bath instead of a hot shower, we understand that due to climate and weather interruptions, it might be challenging to even take a bath. The point where people prefer to now take the hot shower. This technique in a way that it jumps starts your brain function hence leaving you with a clear state of mind. As a surprise, psychology states that those who don't take bathing as a priority tends to be angrier compared to those who bathe regularly. So do your part to not only avoid being in such a list, but also to improve your brain power. Number 10. Stretch. This is another way to calm you down. Since being angry has got to do with muscle contractions and relaxation, stretching helps you relax your muscles reducing your heart beat rate and increases mind functioning. As a normal person some actions may be difficult to take with mind behind it that it may not calm you down as it should be. The reason why we have taken all the time to do this, is to keep you aware of those things you might just be taking for granted and how they might be of so much help to you without even knowing it. So start training yourself today and wait for the future wonders to carry you away. And now visors, what are other ways that you normally use to calm yourself down that we have not mentioned? Feel free to write it in the comments below. And for staying with us up to this point, you deserve a bonus, here is your bonus. Number 11. Do exercises. Sometimes in life, people do exercises to be muscular. But they normally fail to realize that doing this, not only makes them stronger, but also improves their brain power. And you visor, we don't want you to lag behind in the start training your mind to this and make it used to it so that you also be part of the family. Thanks for watching Colina Vid. We do appreciate if you would comment and subscribe. We have more videos that you can also view to improve your knowledge.